Hello everyone, welcome to another war recap, and this time we're against 4PDA.ru, Russian clan as you can see, 83 to 70, it was a bad war for us, everyone were under their level, but we still managed getting the win, so before we go to the war recap, I wanted to ask you if you think that my microphone is good enough, if you can hear me well, and stuff like that, some people contacted me and told me that the mic is pretty bad and I should replace it so let me know maybe I should buy a new mic I don't understand anything in mics they seem to be the all of them seem to be the same for me so let me know and I will try to solve that problem maybe buy a new mic I don't know just let me know put it in the comments under the video so I'll know it's more than one person or not so 79 wins for that clan and they pretty much 3 starred our Town Hall 8, but it ended over there, no 3 stars at all from the Town Hall 8. And we on the other hand also had a pretty bad war, but much more 3 stars as you can see. And this gave us the win. So first attack that I want to show you is number 20. And it's attacked by Jake. So Gohog attack, and as you can see, there are not many locations for the for bombs. The upper parts, there can be two bombs over here, and two bombs in the bottom where he sends the hogs now. And we're gonna take out those arch towers and also detonate both bombs. So great job over here, luring the clan castle as well as detonating two of the bombs and. Now let's see the clan castle gathering. It takes so long, so I'll make it faster. So basically, it gathers them with some barbarians and archers, and takes out all the ground troops with a Valkyrie. It's a known trick, dropping a Valkyrie in the middle of the clan castle. So clan castle is down, and now he's going for the queen. His king is down, so that queen and the wizards are gonna shoot down the enemy queen, and from then. The attack is gonna go very easily as there there are only two double only two giant bombs left and both most likely are in the top. So as you can see the Teslas pop over here and if he uses the spell right and defending his hogs from the Wist Towers, it's gonna be a super easy raid. Although if the max defense is Town Hall 9 and he aims at the king, so great job over here by Jake getting the three star. And as you can see, he detonates one bomb and misses the other. The hogs didn't even step over there. So, bad, bad base design, not putting any bombs, any double bombs against hogs. And this is what you pay for building such a base. So, let's go for the next one. The next attack is going to be number 14. And it's going to be by Masked. So that's the base. It's a known internet base, but I have no idea what's the name of it. I, I've seen the version of Town Hall 10s as well. So if anyone knows the name of this base or Maybe tell me the video link or the link where he found that base. Let me know so I can make a video about it and put it in the news section on the website which shows how to 3 star all popular internet bases. If you don't know about it, go to my website gadyhh.com and the section is called Base Bit. So you will see it in the in the menu and there there are currently 21 bases right now for Town Hall 9 and Town Hall 10 and I plan adding Town Hall 8 and maybe Town Hall 7 if you really want to but I don't know which bases are popular so if you do know just tell me in the comments or contact me on the website with links with photos with whatever and if I see that base being three stars in our wars or in any other wars, then I will definitely put that base in the website so you know how to three star it in different ways. So, meanwhile, while you are listening to me, 
masked, already trashed that base and nice use of, of the balloons and the rage spells and he didn't even use one rage spell and one balloon and now he's gonna use the, those for the last defenses and the balloon is left for cleaning so great job over here sorry for interrupting you with my talking and by the way another thing I added a chat in the in the website so go to the website scroll down to the bottom of any page and you will see the chat where you can ask questions and help each other and stuff like that so I hope it helps you guys I've seen that people are do chat over over there and ask each other questions so that's good that's the whole purpose of it and next one we're going to see is number 11 great attack by Chris so also looks like an internet base if you know the name of the base just let me know and first of all he's using some balloons and hogs to lure the Crown Castle troops if you're using balloons and hogs you can make sure that you also lure all troops that are targeting ground and air in this case all, all troops targeting air as well so it's not it's not hard using just balloons for the clan castle but it's no big deal you can use some hogs as well so he's getting the, the golem and now funneling his way to the enemy queen so wall breakers are going through the wall and now the king is gonna go for the kill and get down the queen and once he's down he can deploy the, the hogs he's not taking many hogs but those are enough to get the whole base down and all he has to do now is use the heal spells in the right location to save those hogs from any enemy wheeze towers so as you can see he covers possible bomb locations together with wheeze towers so great attack over here I really liked it and as you can see even those double bombs didn't kill all hogs because he used those hogs wisely and not just release them in one group so great attack by Chris and the last one we're going to see is a Town Hall 8 attack so which one was that number 31 will be in a separate video and I think it was I don't remember the number I think it was 32 yeah, so attack number 32. And it's a Gohog attack, starting with the Clan Castle Luring. Now we're gonna gather them. So that's the usual role that you should do in pretty much any attack that you're doing. I always recommend luring the Clan Castle unless it's totally impossible and you can deal without luring so golems are going in in two locations and many wizards are getting the whole outer ring half of the base outer ring is going down and the whole idea is waiting with, with the hogs because if you deploy those hogs in the beginning the hogs are gonna go around the base and will be shot down by those spring traps more like not shut down but they're gonna be flying hogs and you want them to stay on ground and that's why you use the golems and the wizards to take out the whole section and once that section is down the way to the center is is totally free and you're not afraid of the spring traps so that's also an internet base for sure I've seen it a couple of times so if you know the name let me know so you've seen that spring traps all the spring traps are in the outer ring and this base is supposed to make your hogs go around the base but in the way he attacked the hogs didn't go around the base so 
just be patient with the hogs and release them in the right time when you have access to the to the core and you will get the three stars so that's it i hope you liked it if you did hit the like button hit the subscribe button comment the comments are free feel free to comment i try reading all the comments and answering all of them so feel free and of course don't forget checking the website the new chat the new section the bit base and if you want to join our clan you can also apply on the website so we'll see each other in the next video bye bye